I now do raffles on my Instagram daily, so if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one, shoot my Instagram a follow. It's jcresells559. Same exact name as my YouTube name. Thank you guys for the support, and I hope to see you in the future raffle. What is up everyone? Today this mystery box just got here from an Instagram reseller whose Instagram is Viper underscore Boulevard. I'll have a screenshot of it right now showing how their Instagram looks. Go shoot them a follow, go maybe run some deals with them. I met them at a sneaker event and they DM'd me. This is my first ever box from them, so hopefully everything goes well. This cost me a thousand ten after shipping. And I forgot if he said specifically, but I'm assuming all brand new, around 20% ROI, because he does well. Because I think he watches my videos. But you can see it's a pretty large box. Again, it is only a thousand, so I'm not I wasn't expecting too many shoes, but again, it is a pretty big box. But yeah, I'm gonna get the box open and let's see what's in it. Alright, here we go. Just gotta cut open. Let's take a look. Never mind, forgot to cut off one of the tapes. Alright, now it's open. So here we go, I already see one shoe. Then I know what it is based off the box. Yeah, there's a good amount of shoes in here for only a thousand. But here's how the box looks. I also see a note in there. I'm assuming it's a list with prices. I already see their logo. So I'm gonna show you guys that real quick. Here it is, Viper Boulevard. So hopefully this is a good box. We can do more business in the future, but here we go. Here's the first shoe overall as Jordan one in the size 10 and a half. I think these are called the Stealth Jordan ones. I've gotten this a few times in the past. Wherever he got it from had it marked at 160. I think market on them is around 120, 140 though. This one comes with some creases on the side, so this might be tried on. But for the most part, super clean, looks brand new. So yeah, guys, this is going to be the first shoe overall. I don't see any extra laces. I don't know if it's supposed to come with it or not, but... Oh yeah, it does have it. And a size 10 and a half right now, going for about 120. So 120 for that, that's gonna be the first shoe overall. Let's go with this dunk. This is going to be a dunk low, woman's dunk low. Size nine and a half women's, eight in men's. And it says pink colorway. I've gotten this once in the past and it sold the same day. So I'm hoping this one sells just as fast. A pink colorway with the size uh i guess i wish it was a little smaller size but um still a decent shoe though and wow market on those is a lot higher than i thought nine and a half in women's going for 190 at the moment i thought it was gonna be like 120 or something like that but anyways that puts me at 310 two shoes in let's go with this i already know what this is gonna be it's gonna be a gray school i think because it's a small box Size four in men's, not for youth. It's usually a pretty big market difference between that. But here it is, the Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. It's a small size, but can't go wrong with these Jordan 1s. One of the best ones ever made. Has a fake receipt and everything. So check this out, a size four youth in those. Going for 175, that's what Lois Ask is. A size four in men's, look at the big difference. Highest bid's already more than Lois Ask for for youth. Lois Ask is at 260. Um, I'm just gonna mark it a little less than Lois Ask because I do think I'm gonna have to sell it through StockX, which is gonna take a fee. I'm gonna mark it at 240. So with 240, that's gonna put me at 550, about halfway or a little over halfway of the price that I paid with three more shoes to go. So six shoes in total. Assuming this is gonna be a Jordan 11. Older label, size 12. <clears throat> oh, it's going to be a Concord Jordan 11s? It's funny, because I just got this same shoe two days ago. I forget what size that was, but this is a shoe you don't get brand new every day. And now I have two brand new in my inventory. I think the other one was a size 11, if I remember correctly, but there it is. One of the best Jordan 11s out there. And a size 12 for the concourse, going for 425. So just like that, that's already gonna put me at 975. That's I think 35 away from what I paid. Still two shoes to go, a Yeezy slide, and then I'm assuming a dunk box. This Yeezy slide's a size 12. Let's see which colorway it is. 
it's gonna be is this a flax yeah the flax colorway so i'm not the biggest fan of this color just a brown colorway but yeah i mean spring's coming up hopefully they sell fast people are gonna start wearing slides again in a size 12 going for 160. so with 160 that's gonna add up to 11.35 so far one more shoe to go it's a like I said, I think <clears throat> this is going to be a dunk box. Yep, dunk low in the size eight and a half. And there are going to be, I think, the something plum, maybe? I don't know. They are brand new. This is actually my first time ever getting these in hand. And I kind of like it. I like the material on it. I love the colorway. I would definitely wear these for sure. But yeah, guys, this is going to be this, the last shoe from the box. The sixth overall shoe. I was right. Those are called the plums. In a size eight and a half, I'm gonna mark it at two hundred five, which is gonna put my total to one thousand three hundred forty dollars for this one thousand. I think in the beginning I said a thousand fifteen. This is actually a thousand ten dollar box. So if I could get those prices, that would be three thirty in profit, thirty two percent ROI. So huge shout out to the sneaker reseller viper boulevard for hooking me up with this box it's a, my first ever one from them and he definitely hooked it up shout out to you if you're watching this let's take a look at his note real quick just to compare his price to mine because i'm kind of curious because he really hooked it up with this his total came out to 1320 so shout out to you for making the box and hooking it up with a profit but yeah guys that's the mystery box let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think of it rate it out of 10 and comment what your favorite shoe is. I know I think most people would probably pick the 11s. But um, I would go with the SB Plums. I love the colorway on that. The suede material. Love that shoe. But yeah, that's going to pretty much wrap up today's video. Remember, if you ever want to run any deals with me or possibly buy any of these shoes, just hit me up on my Instagram. It's jcresales559. It'll be in the description below. But thank you guys for watching. If you guys haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel. Leave a like on the video. And I'll see you guys next time. I now do raffles on my Instagram daily. So if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one, shoot my Instagram a follow. It's jcresells559. Same exact name as my YouTube name. Thank you guys for the support. And I hope to see you in the future raffle.